and happy Wednesday. Today is a special day because it is the first day of our new month. So our new month is April. So that means that today is Wednesday, April 1st, 2020. So for today, we are going to listen to a story. We are going to review the sign for funny. We're going to, I'm going to show you guys a special craft that you can do. And then Miss Sherry is going to pop on for a special activity that you guys can be doing from home. So before I hop on and read Dog on a Frog, I am going to review the sign for funny. And you might think I look funny. My glasses are upside down because April 1st, April 1st, which is today, is also April Fool's Day. So today, a lot of people do tricks. Um, so I have created a cool, funny craft that you guys can do at home to see if you can trick your family. Okay? So let's begin. We are going to review the sign for funny. So to do funny, you're going to take your two fingers and you're just going to like wipe them off your nose. Funny. So you're funny. Um, and our craft is funny. So that is the sign for funny. All right. Let's read our dog on a frog. All right. Let's get started. Dog on a frog. Some of those dogs. Do you have a dog? Do you have a frog? Hmm. Hey dog, get off the frog, said the frog. But I like sitting on frogs, said the dog. Frogs are all squishy and squashy, and when you sit on them, they go, You know the rules, said the cat. Cats sit on mats, frogs sit on logs, and dogs sit on frogs. Well, I'm changing the rules, said the frog. From now on, dogs sit on logs, not frogs. Really, said the dog. Really, said the frog. Dogs sit on logs, and cats sit on Gnats! Ouch! What will bears sit on? asked the dog. Bears will sit on stairs, said the frog. What will slugs sit on? asked the dog. Slugs will sit on plugs, said the frog. Slugs will sit on plugs. Flies will sit on pies. Crickets will sit on tickets. And moss will sit on cloths. What will leopards sit on? asked the dog. Leopards will sit on shepherds, said the dog. Leopards will sit on shepherds. And cheetahs will sit on fajitas. Yum. <laughs> You're really getting the hang of this, said the dog. I know, said the frog, and that's not all. News will sit on canoes, and pigs will sit on wigs, and boars will sit on oars. What will whales sit on, asked the dog. Whales will sit on nails, said the frog. I'm not sure the whales will like that, said the dog. They don't have to like it, said the frog. They just have to do it. Would you want to sit on nails? I wouldn't. What will dragons sit on? asked the dog. Dragons will sit on wagons, said the frog. Dragons will sit on wagons. Mice will sit on ice. Kittens will sit on mittens. And puppies will sit on puppies. What will canaries sit on? asked the dog. 
Canaries will sit on fairies, said the frog. Canaries will sit on fairies. Possums will sit on blossoms. Hens will sit on pens. Baboons will sit on balloons. And poodles will sit on noodles. Poodles aren't going to want to sit on noodles, gasped the dog. They are now, the frog smiled. Hold on, said the cat. If dogs sit on logs and cats sit on gnats, Bears sit on chairs, slugs sit on pugs, flies sit on pies, crickets sit on tickets, moths sit on cloths, leopards sit on shepherds, cheetahs sit on fajitas, gnus sit on canoes, pigs sit on wigs, boars sit on oars, whales sit on nails, dragons sit on wagons, mice sit on ice, kittens sit on mittens, puppies sit on guppies, canaries sit on fairies, possums sit on blossoms, hens sit on pens, baboons sit on balloons, and poodles sit on noodles. What are frogs going to sit on? asked the dog. These, said the frog. The end. The frog had a pretty sweet deal, don't you agree? That was awesome. I love that the rhymes. I love all the different animals and the silly things that they sit on. Okay, so we've reviewed the sign for funny. We've read Dog on a Frog. Now I am going to hop on and show you guys a really silly and easy prank you can pull on your family today. All right, friends, for this April Fool's prank, you will need a large, clear jar. You will also need a silly picture of yourself. I took this picture of myself using photo booth in the big eye effect and then I printed it off I cut it out and then I put tape on both sides so that when I put it in here and cover it with water the picture won't get ruined if you have a laminator that would be the best bet you're going to roll up your picture and put it in so that it looks like your head is in the jar. Next, we're gonna fill the jar up with water, and then you can add food coloring. The picture I saw was kind of a yellowishy water. I don't have any food coloring because this is a last minute April Fool's joke, so I'm just gonna add a little bit of turmeric powder to it, and hopefully that works. All right, friends. So here you have our April Fool's Day joke. You can play on your family, on your friends. So I'm gonna put this in the refrigerator. Then it'll look like there's a head in my refrigerator. There you have it guys. There's my head. All right, are you guys ready for Miss Sherry? Let's see what she has. For. Hi, it's Mrs. Sherry. So today I thought we'd do a little art project and a little outside adventure hunt. So all you need is a piece of paper, plain or colored, some colored pencils or crayons, markers, whichever you'd like to use. So I made up a little scavenger hunt. So you're going to take your paper and you're going to draw pictures of things outside. You can make pictures of anything. These are some of the things that I put on mine. And then you can go outside and see if you can find them. You can either just put an X over which ones you found, or you can use another piece of paper and make tally marks and see how many of each you can find. So have fun with this. See you soon. Bye friends. I hope you have a great rest of your Wednesday. Don't let your friends trick you. Be careful. Be suspicious of everything. Bye, friends. Oh, my goodness. April Fool's Day.